Have a nice day, everyone. This time, we will explain the APU, the auxiliary power unit, life limited parts. Here at the upper rows, the aircraft which the APU installed in it, the registration of the aircraft, the type of aircraft, the APU part number, the APU serial number, the status date of this report, time since new, cycle since new, take care, time since new, it is not the aircraft flight hours, but APU, APU hours, and here cycle, APU cycle, take care, APU and APU, not aircraft, okay? We go to the, the parts, the other chapter, vendor, Honeywell, Description, the part name, APU, this is the assembly, and this is the parts. Compressor rotor, turbine shaft, turbine rotor, turbine rotor. These components and these limits, where you get it, you will go to the APU logbook each apu had a logbook like engine like aircraft each of them had a logbook so you will find these components in the apu logbook what about the times the hours apu hours and the apu cycle the maintenance engineer will print a report with the APU hours and APU cycles. And I asked some friends about that. They said that there are two methods. The first method, this is here, and this is the second method here to get the APU hours and APU cycles. And this is the limit 30,000 APU cycle. Okay. Again, you can get this data from the APU logbook and you calculate the remaining to take care when you remove your APU to go to the A APU workshop to make overall or replacement, so and so. This is as a guide for you to help you as a record engineer. Thank you very much and goodbye.